What's going on YouTube? Yankees Jets fan 71 back with another video. Uh, so actually it's one, I wanted to do this really quickly. I got a package in the mail today. Originally I bought this 1980 late 70s Spider-Man ruler for the Spider-Man collection. And my friend who I bought the ruler from actually threw in some cards for me. So let's really quickly go over it. I have a Michael Carter rookie card from Prestige. Um, I think he's going to be the featured Jets back really, really soon. He's had a couple of good games. Uh, speaking of someone who's had a couple of good games for Carolina, Sam Darnold. This is like the red, I believe, the red foil ver variant. Got a couple of the Babe Ruth cards from the Leaf set. I'm sh sure I needed all these. I, I think I'm going to try to put this leaf set together at some point. Looks like it's got some really nice cards and some ni really nice pictures in the set. Um, he also, also threw in this Don Russ 2018 Aaron Judge card. And he also threw in this Don Russ foil from 20, I think it's 21. Yep, and it's number two, 2021. Really nice card, did not have that. He also threw in this um, Luke Voigt Elite Series card, which I don't believe I have. And finally he threw in this Topps Aaron Judge 2021 card. So that's pretty much it. Uh, not, I'm still not really getting into the cards really too much right now. Um, I do get some here and there, but for the most part, I'm trying to still just, I'm taking it easy from cards. I've been concentrating more on the bobbleheads and picking up pieces for my Spider-Man collection here and there. Um, but when I do get the cards, I will post the videos here so you guys can take a look. Um, I think it's more the reason why I'm taking a break is because I'm all... Kind of tired out from the cards, seriously, because and now the fact that Tops losing the license and so is Panini, and Fanatics is getting it. I don't know where that's gonna get, head to, and it's just frustrating because I love Tops. Tops is my favorite, and without Tops, it's like why even bother collecting? You know, although I did like Panini, I always said that if Panini got a license, Panini would rival Tops. Now then, Fanatics got the license, so what does that mean? Are they gonna? license out the license to tops or panini or are they going to make cards themselves and from what i understand are other cards even going to be sold in stores or it's going to be sold exclusively on the fanatic site i don't know anyway i'm rambling it's late yankees win tonight over the rangers for three i'll be smiling when i sleep tonight guys if you like the video please click that like button hit all comments down below and click that subscribe button if you want to see more videos such as the one you've seen here tonight Hope you guys have a great night, and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.